amazing anti-human trafficking organization dedicated to put an end to modern day slavery. We are fully supporting the high school that they have for girls 13 to 18 years old, where they teach them vocational skills, they give them jobs. We actually are, they make jewelry, very fine jewelry that we're actually selling at our booth, shameless plug, um, in the expo, Hall A. Go over and grab some. Because these are actual girls who are rescued from a life of bondage that now have a vocation, now that they have a skill, they have a way to bring themselves out of their circumstances. That's empowerment, not enablement, empowerment. We're empowering these girls to take their own future. African Hearts brings boys out of the slums. The picture I showed just earlier of the slums, they bring kids out of those slums, provide schooling, provide meals, provide medical attention, provide a home for these children. I am very pleased to announce that last year at convention, you raised enough funds to be able to build a nursery school for these kids. Probably you're going to be here in just about a week. We will do the ribbon cutting on that school, so look for pictures on Facebook and email to see that 200 new kids will have the opportunity to have an education because you cared a year ago. extensively with African Hearts to double the impact of their current programs. So now, instead of the children receiving meals three days a week, they receive them five days a week. Instead of receiving English classes and medical attention three days a week, they receive it five days a week. Twice as many kids are able to stay in their transitional homes. And if they have families, twice as many are relocated with their families. That's impact that you guys make it possible on a real person's life. It's pretty awesome, right? Yeah, it's super awesome. So hope, last year, we also raised enough money to build an outreach home for Soul Hope. The government has been a little bit frustrated but we have broken ground and are on our way to build it. Because we see what is and is, what could be and not what is, right? Healing Faith Uganda, this is an organization that does malaria education, treatment, prevention. When we began our partnership, they were protecting they were laying 400 nets a month. Now, they're laying 4,000 a month. That's a thousand percent increase. A thousand percent impact that you have because you're willing to give up your means to help someone else. Young Living Academy. This is our school in Ecuador. In March of this year, we had graduation, our very first graduating class. 100% of our kids graduated in an area 